So my name is Justin Schmitz. I've been working as a photographer in the Midwest my entire life. I moved to Chicago to attend Columbia College where I got my Bachelor's of Fine Art. And then I have my uh, MFA from Yale University. Uh, this year, I have been photographing at Taft and the Taft Freshman Academy. This is my third year working at Taft, and I'm so excited to sort of be there again. At Taft, I'm most interested in the extracurriculars. I tend to attend things like football games or homecoming dances or sporting events or club uh, activities. I'm most interested in the time outside of the classroom. My interest in photographing young people has a lot to do with how they socialize with one another, how they sort of interact. So I think that photographing at these events allows me to look at my subjects and sort of understand the way that seems most opportune for me as a as an artist and a photographer. I knew I was interested in Taft because they had a really kind of amazing community, but I don't really tend to put so many sort of goals or expectations on the work. I try to sort of make the work and see what uh, it needs to be. Working at Taft has been incredible just because I think the administrative support is amazing. They really invite me in, they really sort of allow me to do what I want to do, and they have created such an atmosphere of positivity and inclusion that um, they're just sort of really excited for me to sort of see their community and see uh, what they do in that school. Photography and video is a language that I think I understand the most readily. Um, I think it is one of those mediums that allows me to express my sort of thoughts and feelings about the world in a way that maybe speaking or writing or if I was a painter, I don't think I would sort of be able to do as clearly and thoughtfully. So some of my biggest artistic influences, um, and these sort of change sort of on a daily basis, but I think uh, the French filmmaker Robert Bresson is a huge influence on my work. Uh, Al Hussar Balthazar is one of the most poignant and direct and emotional movies I've ever seen in my life, and I feel like if my work strives to be anything, it strives to be emotional and intense and I think that Brisson really understands the medium of filmmaking in a way and sort of understands what's unique about it and I think for my picture making I try to make work that can only be a photograph. You know I wouldn't necessarily call it inspiration I feel like I owe a huge debt to all of the people who were teachers in my life, all of my friends, uh, the support system that I've had who've helped me sort of like become an artist. They've turned me on to music and books and uh, other art that I can sort of uh, take from. And I think without that sort of support system, I don't think I'd sort of be able to be in the position to make what I make. I don't know if this is embarrassing, but I sort of maybe think it's a little traumatic because I still think about it a fair amount. The first day of high school, this kid looked at my shoes, asked me if I was a skater, then called me a poser and pushed me down the stairs. And so that sort of incident like stuck with me uh, for a very long time. I kind of have always felt like a poser <laughs> and um, I don't necessarily think that's a bad thing. I would say that uh, the look that I was going for in high school was definitely like Midwestern, hardcore, emo. So like really big pants and running shoes, really small t-shirts, a ton of choker necklaces and bracelets. And I don't think I went anywhere without a backpack. Uh, my advice to current high school students is it gets better. Yeah, I think it gets better.